So just by reading the question and looking at the marking criteria, you can sort of get an idea of what they're looking for, which helps with the planning of the assignment. Well, I usually just sort of like gather, you know, like different, um, I suppose like sort of different top or different topics that are related to the topic you are searching for or books or, you know, journals and so on. Because then you sort of have like a clear idea if you're on the right track. I actually use the time I drive to, to and from uni thinking about and coming up with ideas and a plan. Uh, yeah, I do. Uh, sometimes we have the freedoms to come out with our own essay questions and what we're going to address. So I, I sort of don't rush into it. I suppose I'm not one of those people who will go first. I'll sit back and watch other people do it first so I'll get a bit of an idea and then away I'll go. But um, yeah, that's probably the way I, I go about it. But uh, yeah, I do have a good thing about it. I just like to read the questions thoroughly and write points on each thing of the question. So if it was analysed five ways a sport could be played for youths, you might look at the five ways and say, okay, what does five ways actually mean? You know, what do I write it on? So really analyse the questions. Um, yeah, that's sort of what I've been doing. Yeah. Probably just read up on it from the textbook and slides and stuff.